Hi guys, today I am finally going to be cutting up my party on shower jelly. This did win my poll as to what shower jelly to cut next and do a bubble bath with. 75% of you chose this one here. And the party on shower jelly, we're just gonna get right on into it and start cutting it up. The scent of this is a lime and menthol smell, just has a very strong, minty um, zinginess to it, a very nice vibe vibrant color as well. So I'm excited to get this chopped up, so let's do it. Look at how vibrant that color is. It's like highlighter. You can kind of see through this, it's really cool, the color. To me, the scent of this reminds me of a key lime pie, but with a mintiness to it. So you can use as much or as little of this as you want if you are using it to make a bubble bath. I'm probably going to use maybe a little more than half just because I like to do things in excess. So I'm going to use about that much here in mine. And I just want to mention also if you are new to Lush Shower Jellies, maybe you've never used one before, these have multiple uses. You can use them as body wash. You can use them as I'm doing right here with bubble bath. Um, Lush even says you can use them in your hair as like shampoo. They soap up just like any kind of soap would. You can freeze them, you can refrigerate them so they have more of a cooling sensation on your skin as well. Just lots of multiple uses. And just to make sure you guys know, at the end of this video, I will also have another poll up on a jelly that you can vote for as my next one. So stay tuned for that to the end.
of the bubbles that I got from the Party On Shower Jelly. Got about a foot of bubbles here. Um, I never go too crazy with my bubbles though. This is still a lot of bubbles for my bubble bath. Um, the scent of this is very, very strong. I think this would be perfect if you have a cold because you can really feel that um, menthol in there, kind of like in the back of your throat. It is like super duper strong. Kind of reminds me of a cough drop um, as far as the scent goes, but I do smell the lime in there, which is nice. I do like that lime scent, but this might be a little bit too strong for me. I think my boyfriend would really like it though. Uh, but as far as our watercolor goes, that like ectoplasm green didn't really transfer um, into our watercolor. It's just a very light, almost like mint green kind of color. Alright, so I am going to hop on in here and enjoy my bubble bath and I'll be back with what I thought afterwards. Alright guys, I'm finished with my party on shower jelly bubble bath. As usual with any bubble bath, just have some bubbles to clean down the tub. As far as the scent goes on this, I don't really smell it on my skin. I think this would be perfect to freeze or chill in your refrigerator when maybe you're just feeling a little sick down, down in the weather kind of feeling. Um, definitely that scent is going to open up your nostrils. It is a very strong menthol uh, mintiness going on there. Uh, but overall, I thought it still made a very nice bubble bath um, and made lots of bubbles for the amount that I used. Uh, but let's hop on over to this poll so you guys can vote on the next shower jelly. Option number one is Happy Blooming. Option number two is Ghost. Option three is Sweetie Pie. And option four is 93,000 Miles. So what you have to do is click on the little I at the top to cast your vote in the poll. And I will see you guys next time.